Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to the video game capital of the world presented by Galaxy of Gaming. We are here at the e um, Otumwa Esports Championship Sunday and we got a great exhibition for you guys. So we're going to be doing Street Fighter V. We got some, some champions, some evil veterans here. We got KDZ, we got Hero, and we have Sanford Santrax Kelly from Empire Acadia. No, no, the first match is going to be you versus Hero. Um, it's a th triple threat exhibition, right? The triple threat exhibition um, between the three um, Street Fighter players in Empire Acadia. And it's going to be a first of five each um, match and set. And this is when you're going to see we're going to come out with a, a winner at this triple threat match. This may be an annual thing to have in a tri triple threat exhibition. But uh, yes, KDZ is getting ready right now. And um, Hero is getting himself ready. Hero will be playing Bison. I have no idea who um, KDZ is going to be playing. He has a, a, a large uh, arsenal of characters to pick from. He plays Armika. He plays, uh, uh, not Karen. I don't know if he plays Karen, but he, I know he also plays Nakali. He, uh, Ibuki. He's played Ryu in the past, but I think he's dropped Ryu. Um, but we'll see who he picks. This is coming up right now. Let me take a look at the... The match, uh, there we go. So here it is, guys. It's a triple threat, um, triple threat exhibition. First to five to complete um, a set per person, and then we move on. So we have it set up as this. It will be, um, it will be Hero versus KDZ. Then after that, we'll have Hero versus Santrax, and then after that, we'll have Santrax versus KDZ. We're working on getting our commentators here. Actually, let me see something. All right, so guys, all right, we got we got a commentator here. We're gonna have these guys commentating each other's match while Sanford is waiting for the next set. No, I just came up with that right now. Alright, we'll go. Nah, I'm relax. So here's Santrax. He's gonna commentate this match right here. Good evening, everyone. What's going on? We got Seth Kelly on the mic. Round one. And uh, we got some Street Fighter 5 action. You saw me get washed by the man KDZ in Tekken. But it's okay. I'm trying to get some vengeance on him in Jaron. Because Jaron beat me last time we played in this game. Oh, 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 okay, I like that. Yeah, KDZ, man, he's a very, very diverse player. He can play any game if he puts his mind to it. He gets good at any game fast. And uh, that's a talent that's really hard to have for a lot of players. Because they, they take a long time to learn games. He learns them quick. He learns sentences quick as well. Um, and, um, <laughs> Ron, uh, Got a little throw loop at the corner going on. Um, the thing with Bison, how he's used particularly, he has to control the ground. You can jump at him at certain times, but you ha he has to control that ground. He does not have an attack reversal like Ken or Kali, where he can uppercut and it's visible with bars, which is what we call meters. Um, he doesn't particularly have it. All he has is defend, backdash, or reversal. The reversal takes his. B trigger bar. Not all the way down, but it takes some of it. So he needs to uh, defend most of the time when you're attacking. He doesn't have a move that's visible to get blocked. Like that, the reason why that worked is because um, KZ didn't hit him physically with an attack. If he hit him physically with an attack, he wouldn't have been able to do that. So it's not visible. And, and oh man, KZ could have super him. But um, it's okay. He still has to that was tricky, and hey, that's first game. Um, hero. Uh, the thing about Jaron is particularly and he's Bison number wins. ranked number twelve on PSN in this game worldwide. That means that in the world, this is Europe, this is Japan, this is Korea, this is wherever you name it. He's number twelve in the world, which means he has top two or number one Bison in the world, rank wise on PSN. So. He, he's a monster, <laughs> and, and <laughs> uh, 
it's gonna be an uphill battle for me or KDZ to beat this man. But um, KDZ's holding his own though. Like you know, he has this cool pressure right now. His plan is really, really cons conservative. Uh, Geronis, uh, he's not wasting a lot of meters. He's trying to, he's, he's, he's try, he's trying to win these, these rounds without wasting a car. Because if he ever needs to uh, come apply pressure, he can just waste an EX on the uh, EX Devil Reverse. Like that. <laughs> but that's the regular one. But the EX one hits multiple times. It's about three times. And he can do EX Scissor Kicks, which is plus freeze. Which he gets another attack afterwards. Not necessarily like that. That's plus frames. He can swing after that. But the thing, the gamble, the gamble with that is, um, KZ can waste the meter to uppercut out of that, which is his invincible move. And, um, it was a greatly time crunch rounds. Uh, stop the pressure to drown from um, Pyro was doing. Pyro is in control of this right now. Um, nice command grab. And, uh, doesn't really get a follow up after that, but it's still good pressure to, wow, what a hit it is. What a good day my heart. That was so sick. And um, Phil's, Phil's not Phil's not done yet. He still has a super. Oh, it's sick. Alright, we got 2 0. Um, when when KDZ hit the standing strong, he didn't buy it. But I guess he probably wanted to save it. Because it wouldn't have killed. It would have just gave him a setup. But. The next hit after that, if he would have completed a combo into a super hit, it would have killed. So, maybe, maybe he would have, maybe he was trying to reserve his bars. But we don't, we don't know that. But um, I'm just assuming. And uh, we're going to one of the new stages that was released a couple of months ago. Personal favorite of mine, other than the train stage in Hillside Plaza. We got Metro City Bay Area. Uh, this is Abigail's stage. Abigail is one of the new characters that was released around Evo. Um, he was debuted at Evo. They had a trailer for him at Evo. And this is his stage. So he's also the biggest character in Street Fighter history. Round one. And here we go. We got game game three on the way. Um, he switches to Buki. And uh, Muki is a very strong character. She has a lot of tools. Uh, like Nakali, but different type of tools. Ron is harassing right now. <laughs> With, like, no regard for anything the KDC might do. <laughs> they call Bison Mr. Plus Wings. Oh, wow. Not to do that? Oh. And, uh... He had, to, he had to mix up the one. Nice. Drawn just did it to put him in blocks. That was a good block by KZ. Nice reversal. She has a reversal as well. Um, she has EXP, Dragon Punch. Uh, which is nice. He could have he could have made that a lot worse, but he, he hesitated. <laughs> and, and there you have it. Bison with the pressure. That's Mr. Plus Frames. That's what we call him. Round two. Oh man, KDZ tried to press a button, he was counter headed by Psycho Axe with down four tears. Which is one of the best neutral moves in this entire game. Oh, I missed this combo. He's got a pretty good And nice. And, uh, oh, we got a stun, we got a stun, we got a stun. Okay, what is he gonna do from this? What is he gonna do from this? And, oh, he resets. And, there you go. <laughs> and uh, all right, we got a round. We got a, we got some, we got a round for the board. Let's go, let's go. We making it interesting. And uh, KDZ has a bar. So what, how is it gonna be? Nice bar, nice punch. And, and that's so ambiguous. It's so hard to block. Oh wow, great jump. Here was a st stun territory. If he gets hit again, all right, now the stun went down. So the stun went down. Him. KDZ has a, a very, very big lead, but now, okay, now, Jaron's trying to make a comeback. Nice grab. Stop him, stop him from teleporting forward to get the mix-up off. Good blocks by KDZ, but now, if he gets hit again, he's stunned. He has to make a decision here whether to, oh, and that'll be it. <laughs> that screws her off for Jaron. Jaron, a.k.a. hero. Uh, 
No, it's Jeff. It's Bob. It's Bob. It's Bob. It's Bob. It's Bob. It's Bob. And uh, it's 3-0. This is the third win for uh, players. KDC has to make some adjustments. He had that game, but he twice. Jerron ran away, let his stun bar go down, and it, it reset the whole situation. Again. Nice. That that cool night when she uh, glows like that, it's an EX. It's plus, I think, plus 16. So it's a lot. She can go with full again. I wrote a rest again. This might be the round. This, this might be. This might be. Hey, all right. That is Lord Bison. <laughs> And uh, and KDC down again. And shout out to everybody in the stream. I mean, well, can't say I miss you guys because I haven't seen you all in forever or haven't met you yet. But I would like to soon. <laughs> I'd like to be around, you know, my brother and sister. Like to, you know, something that I really, really appreciate. This is the reason I come out. So, in any event, going back to the game. Oh, we got a stun. KDC has stunned him. And this is the second stun that KDC has stunned. He tried to he tried to do command, but he got the knife instead. I think he did the wrong motion. It happens. Uh, he still has to all the SP. Oh, he got hit by the He has to block this. This the plus frames. At it again. This the plus frames. This the plus frames. This the plus frames. Is all right. And we got 4-0. And come on, don't get five oh, don't, don't get five old KZ. Come on. Not the police. Don't let them five you. All right, no five o. <laughs> and <laughs> give me look at frustrated. Wow. This the plus phrase. So cheap. <laughs> what is that? All right, nice part of this. And um, she said here, kitty cat, and. Nice. And that's a stun again. The third stun. Alright. You gotta block this. You gotta block this. You gotta block this. Got oh god. He has to block it again. He has to block it again. Alright. Okay. Alright. The block is hard though. It's hard to block it. Tried to block it. And it <laughs> Hyro is on oh, back point. <laughs> and. <laughs> oh, guys, and it's not looking good. He has to make an adjustment now, and that's the a drastic adjustment. And nice throw, nice throw again. And, oh, Mr. Plus Range is at it. Oh, Mr. So plus. Why can't he swing? He's afraid that. All oh, right, he had, he had. That might be it. Right, yes, one more guess. One more guess and still up. Uh, one more guess. One more, one more guess. This is the close one. This is the close one. Can KDZ hang on? It, oh, he hung on with the B trigger. And it's gonna blow him up? Oh, right. uh, he hangs on. Okay. Oh, wow. And what a whiff punishment. The Psycho Axe. All right, we're getting we're getting trades um, in favor of Bison. Nice. Uh, and nice. And what do we have here? What do we have here? Sabi trigger. Oh, he missed the combo. Oh, he missed the combo. It's not looking good. He can still win this though if he lands a hit. That's game. <laughs> and this is, we got a close one here. Oh wow! 
Oh, we got Fazo from Gerard, aka Hyrule, with the do in dominant fashion. <laughs> and Bison wins. Uh, do I play him now? Do I play you or him? I play you or him. Okay.